Good day, everybody. I bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. And I really desire that you have got such an amazing day today that the goodness and the love of Yahweh will really consume and overflow you. And this morning, the Lord speaks to us out of Galatians 5, verse 17 and 18. And I'm reading out of the Amplified. It says, For the desires of the flesh are opposed to the Holy Spirit, and the, the desires of the Spirit are opposed to the flesh, godless human nature. For these are antagonistic to each other, continually withstanding and in conflict with each other, so that you are not free but are prevented from doing what you desire to do. But if you are guided, led by the Holy Spirit, you are not subject to the law. We are in a sensitive time in creation. We are in a sensitive time in our own lives. And this is a time that we really need to look at our intimacy with God, but the dimension of the Holy Spirit. Remember that Jesus said, I'm going to heaven now in John 14, and you will receive your comforter, your partner. He's the one that is the voice of Yahweh out of heaven um, that you are hosting, that's in you, that's around you, that's upon you. And that leads you into everything. And he's the one that keeps your eyes away from what is going on in the world, away from fleshly desires into heavenly desires, into the purpose and the will of which God has for you here on the earth. And that we really need to relook really at our relationship with the Holy Spirit. And that is the only way that we stay focused all the time and we move back to where we only do and we only say and we only react according what the Holy Spirit tells us to do. And when we as sons of God are going to walk in that time and that dimension, walking in such harmony and unity, we will be the ones doing the greater miracles of God. And we will be the ones that brings a desire into each and other, every person out there, even creation, to, be, to become closer and in unity with the Holy Spirit. By just focusing on, on Him and being obedient, you will be a great person of influence as it is in heaven, here on earth. I bless you with that in the name of Yahweh.